Welcome to Star Wars Transmissions, I'm Dan. Issue 7 of Kevin Scott's High Republic comic series recently included a very interesting Sith Lord by the name of Darth Krall. So who is Darth Krall and what do we know about him? Let's take a look at everything we currently know about this Dark Lord of the Sith. Darth Krall, originally known as Radaki, was a male Force-sensitive individual. He was first mentioned in canon on April 30th, 2019 in Kevin Scott's audiobook Dooku Jedi Lost, and Star Wars fans got to see the Sith Lord for the first time on June 29th, 2021 when Mike Mayhew released an image of his variant cover for issue 7 of Kevin Scott's High Republic comic series, which featured the Sith Lord. A month later, however, Krall debuted in a Force Vision in the aforementioned seventh issue of the High Republic, which was released on July 28, 2021. Although we don't know at this time what species Darth Krall is, nor when he was born or died, it's a safe bet to assume Darth Krall is an ancient Sith Lord, which we'll dive deeper into later on in the video. Krall was a former Jedi of the Jedi Order, however, However, he left the Order at some point and was seduced by the dark side of the Force as a result of his belief that the Jedi should retain their family ties and wealth. After his fall to the dark side and departure from the Jedi Order, Krall became part of what was later known as the Lost Twenty, which was a group of 20 Jedi Masters who left the Jedi Order throughout its history. Speaking of the Lost Twenty, do you think we'll see any High Republic era Jedi become one of the Lost Twenty? Let us know down in the comments. Having forsaken his allegiance to the Jedi Order, Radaki then adopted the name of Darth Krall and rose to become a powerful Dark Lord of the Sith. As a Sith, Krall wore a black and red cloak and wielded a red-bladed lightsaber with a golden hilt. At some point, Krall participated in what was called the Battle of Wasted Years and emerged from the battle victorious. Additionally, he tamed what was called the Nightmare Conjunction. Although there's not much information on what exactly the Nightmare Conjunction was, we do know that, during the High Republic era, ancient records that dated back to the days of the Nightmare Conjunction were used to aid in the Jedi Order's fight against the Drengear. This then brings us back to the time period Darth Krall was alive during. Although we don't know the exact dates as to when Krall lived, based on the information regarding the Nightmare Conjunction, that Darth Krall tamed it, and that ancient Jedi records mention the event, we can surmise that Darth Krall is in fact an ancient Sith Lord. The story of Krall taming the Nightmare Conjunction was also first mentioned in Kevin Scott's audiobook, Dooku Jedi Lost. In that novel, Count Dooku, during his time as a Jedi initiate, within the Jedi Order, first learned about Darth Krall from Jedi Masters Eula, Braylon, and Yoda when they enlightened Dooku and several initiates on the Lost Twenty. Later in that audiobook, the Jedi Sifo Dyas, also an initiate at that time, explained to Dooku that he originally learned about Darth Krall, how the Sith Lord won the Battle of Wasted Years and tamed the Nightmare Conjunction from the Hollow Journal of Clias Teradin, a Jedi Padawan who was supposedly expelled from the Jedi Order during the time of the High Republic. Additionally, Dooku and Sifo Dyas also saw Darth Krall's lightsaber when they snuck into the hidden vault in the Jedi Temple on Coruscant, known as the Bogan Collection, or the Archive of Forbidden Artifacts within the Jedi Archives. During the High Republic era, Darth Krall appeared before the Jedi Knight Keith Trennis in a Force vision she had while meditating after she was infected by the Drengear. In her vision, Krall attacked the Jedi Knight and stabbed her with his lightsaber, all while Keith had some wild-ass premonitions. And there you have it. That's everything we know about the Sith Lord, Darth Krall, at this time. Seeing how Darth Krall has only appeared in stories penned by Kevin Scott, my assumption is that the next time we see Darth Krall, it will be in a Kevin Scott story. The good news is that Kevin Scott is writing the High Republic comic series, which essentially drops new issues each month, and he's also one of the story architects of the High Republic, and will continue to write novels and stories for this golden era of Star Wars. I think there's a good chance we'll see Darth Krall appear again, and I can't wait. But what's your thoughts on Darth Krall? Is he a Sith Lord you'd like to learn more about. Let me know down in the comments. If you like this video, please help out the channel by hitting that like button and making sure you subscribe. Follow the channel on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, all at Star Wars Transmissions. Thanks for watching and stay nerdy.